what's an example of one of these best practices that you thought were like fundamental that now you're questioning? I think that there are like a lot of things that we just sort of like establish solutions for how to do things that, for example, if we want to rearrange or filter content on a page, we have tools and forms to do these things. And there's just like a lot of things where, um, you know, Veronica, you'll say, it's like, why do we need to do that? That like, but why wouldn't the interface be smart enough to figure it out? Because we're at a moment, I mean, this is what sentient design is all about, when we can create actually genuinely new kinds of experiences when we weave intelligence into the interface. And so it is this moment of being like, wait, do these best practices still apply? We have an opportunity now where the interface can be reactive in new ways, interpreting intent rather than us having to sort of guide every step, but also proactive in terms of creating new kinds of where the interface reaches out to make decisions and participates in some cases in what we call the NPC pattern, the non-player character pattern, participate as another user in the system as well. 